just incredibly inspiring to hear your story. Yours is a story that more people need to hear because um, it inspires other young people, particularly young people that are undocumented, mm -hmm. to know that they can, they can succeed. I come here to the United States in 2006, undocumented. I enrolled in high school in 2008 because unlike many parents, my mom's plan was for me to work, not to go to school. I convinced her, I said, I need to speak English, mom, I need to. I'm tired of going to McDonald's and say, can I order something, right, in Spanish? And they were like, I don't speak Spanish, you know, the guy who speaks Spanish is taking a break. Oh, you mean I have to wait? I was tired of that. Um, for anything, I was very moved by the perseverance to overcome any obstacle ahead of you. It may be difficult, it may seem like you can't do yourself out of a hole, but there will be people like him that will help you get through that. And there are examples like him that will make sure, that will set um, an example for you to strive for, no matter what you do. Besides my professional experience at work, I made it my mission to inspire others, like myself, who may have grown up without parents, who may have gone to school during tough times, who may not have had documents like me. It was, it was, very, it was great. I enjoyed it very, very much. So you're the kind of speaker that keeps an audience awake and not bored. <laughs> great job. I just, I was not looking for a handout. I was desperately seeking for a hand up.